Hello, in this video I'll be going over your printer's delay. Let's go ahead and hit print settings and then if you hit printhead, this is where you will find your delay setting. Um, the interface allows you to choose from multiple print heads as you only have one. You'll just go ahead and leave it on one all the time. Now you have two ways to set this. You have a global delay value here and then you have your printhead one offset value which is just a delay. I can change this global delay value here, and as you see, they all change, which is good. I can change the first one that way as well if I'd like to, so I'm simply adding um, more delay to each box at the same time with this one or less. Um, for you, for your printer, I would recommend just using the first box. And so in the video here, you'll see, I'll go ahead and set this delay to 50. And right here you can see that when I run the print, that the print lines up somewhere on the right side of the box. Um, but I want it to move over to the left side some more. So I'll give you a, a, a large example of what it would look like if I just increase this by 100 to 150. And now you'll see that the print lines up much further to the left than it did before. And it's as simple as that, setting your delay, there is some um, trial and error involved. So I recommend making large incremental changes each time so you can really get a feel for the movement. Um, now, making sure that your speed is set correctly is going to be very important for this one, and you'll see that in the next video. Thank you.